In this video we're going to learn how to design a classroom website using a wiki host uh, including the title, uh, subtitle, and top navigation. So let's take a look at how this is done using the wiki host edit me. I'm going to come up to settings in the upper right hand corner. You see I'm on my classroom website and I get to a very user friendly dashboard. So what you see over here are all of the tabs you will use from time to time while using a uh, wiki hosted classroom website. Uh, this one hosted by Edit Me. So the first thing I'm going to do is come down to design. Now I've already registered, remember, I've registered at Edit Me and I've gotten a URL which is a web address for my site. So now I'm going to come into design and the first thing I'm going to do is come down to skins. And these are templates that I can use. So I could decide which one I want. Uh, I think for teacher sites the best one is usually the Yorktown, but you can get any one of these colors you want. So I would click on that and then I would just click apply this skin and then you'll see when you get to your site all of those changes will be made and your site would look like that. All right Now let's say that uh, uh, I want to now change the name of my site and I want to give it a title and also a subtitle. I'm still in design and I'm going to come down to uh, skin settings and up here uh, I've got a variety of things to choose from. I'm going to go to banner text and as you can see I've got my title as Mr. Barnes Virtual Language Arts and I've selected the color yellow because I have a blue background so yellow look ni looks nice. I've got the subtitle it's all just a mouse click away uh, that's white but let's say I wanted to change it I would just come in here and I can you know move this bar down to any place I want if I want to make it green I can click on that and you know I could click done and, and that would be in there and then I could save those settings but I don't want to do that at this point. Let's say I want an image you know you saw I had an image on mine and uh, I have uploaded this from my computer. Here's another image I use. Sometimes I use this one. So all you'll do is click browse. And remember, you have to have the image already saved on your computer. It can be anything. It could be something you get from your school. Uh, it could be something you get from the internet as long as you have permission. And you would just get that and click on it so that it goes into this field and click upload. And that's how uh, you would add that banner image. All right, so uh, anyway, that's under design. Now, let's say that I want to add to my top navigation. So if, if I exit out of this, we see this is what's called top navigation up here, and this is a side menu. And uh, I want my most popular pages up here. All right, so I always keep a current unit. So we had a project we were working on with a novel we did. I created a page for that, and you'll be creating pages, many of them, for your wiki-hosted classroom website. So I always want that current project up here. So in order to do that, I'm going to go back to Settings. I'm going to go back to Design. And I'm going to come down to Skin Settings. And now I want Navigation. Okay, so I'm navigating around my site and I want to come down to customize the navigation and menu area and what I want is organize tab of the navbar page navbar one which is your top navigation and you see in here what I've got are all of these now these are child pages of top navigation so you don't want to add a parent page I don't think I, I believe all you want our child pages because they're going to go on the top. And you see, I have all of those here. Here is that skin I'm in page. So all I have to do is come in here and, and start typing. And, and look at that. That's the only thing I have with SK. And it pops right up. And I would click on that. And then I would just click add. And it goes into here. And uh, if I want something to go under that, I can even click there. And I could add a child to that page as well. So you can get drop down uh, menus and, and really create very nice navigation on your website okay and that that brought me back into here and uh, you know maybe I want to go back to settings and I want to do some other things here's your security and we're going to talk about security later on uh, that's in here uh, general site settings are in here deleted pages if you delete something you want to come in here to make sure that you delete it and that is navigating a wiki hosted website using edit me